First of all, I am thrilled to have my head out from inside a snail. I mean, it's, it's a nice place to visit, but I wouldn't want to live in there. Oh, don't get me wrong, I, I love snails. Some of my best friends are gastropods. An evening inside a snail is uh, kind of like another day at work. Well, it, you know, it's kind of nice to work anonymously. Uh, that way, if the material doesn't go over, uh, I don't get blamed. Oh, my speaker's up tonight. I'm a fight till I see the sun like... You know, this is not my field. They asked to do it. I thought, I love challenges. Why not? Go do it. See how you do. And I found out, you know what? J-Lo, it's tougher than it looks. You know, it was a lot of stress, but I did have fun doing it. Was it easy? Absolutely no. It was a lot of work from picking what songs to do to getting the lyrics down to find out what the tracks are going to be and try to figure out the timing, especially like with TikTok, a lot of beats. So walk. Sing a song, remember the lyrics, hit your marks, stay in key, and hit the beat is tough. Yeah, it burns, burns, burns. Yeah. The ring of fire. Take it off! No, not that! Take it off! Take it off! Take it off! Take it off! Oh my god! Daddy Trail! No, no, no. It is like a complete transformation the minute you put that on. It's like a lot of actors like to stay in character. Well, all my movies are prisons or bad guys, and I don't like staying in that character. But this was just like fun. And it was like, man, I was the cutest raccoon in the world. You know, working with the coaches and the, the choreographers, they knew, you know, I wasn't like a trained singer. So they made it really easy for me. You know, it's like, okay, one, two, three, four. Wow thing! I always say the sky's the limit. You know, I'd rather shoot for the moon and miss than aim for the gutter and make it. And today we shot for the moon. You know, I was a rock star. I ain't been afraid of any deviation. And I don't. Podcasting, creating content, these are things I'm comfortable with. I've been doing for a while. They're, they're my, it's my thing. Can I be honest with you? I'm stepping into a realm that I've never been in and pushes me out of, the, out of my comfort zone in a way that I've never felt before. Being on The Masked Singer is incredibly hard. I am thoroughly excited to go back to being uh, Jake Paul's brother. Girl, you are my world. You're so sweet. Take it off. Nisi has been doing an amazing job until tonight. She chose completely wrong. She kicked me off the show. <laughs> right before the, the song starts, I felt my heart beating bad. I'm like, wait, huh? This, <laughs> I don't get nervous. Like, what is, what is I, I know what was going on, but I was legitimately nervous. And I think it was probably more to, uh, cause I wanted to keep the secret. I didn't want anybody to guess me, so. Yeah, the, 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 the nervousness is a feeling I've never felt on this set before. I dedicated my performance because you truly are a queen and you stepping in for me when, you know, during my sickness, during a hard time for me. I truly do thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, I love you, friend. Uh, and the mass singer really illuminated the fact that I've got a lot to learn as a singer and I can still grow even at my old age. And when my kids Lydon and Hartley uh, see the show and they see that their daddy was revealed as the orca, their little wigs are gonna be knocked back and then they're gonna kind of look at it and go, Dad, why don't you do better? Orca's head was already big to begin with, hearing about uh, these compliments, but after that I was like, wow, 
I think I can win this thing. My point is, scare yourself, challenge yourself. And uh, if you ever come to Sugar Ray Show, I'll uh, try and see if they'll let me borrow Orca, but don't count on it. But I will be there, and I will be there with passion, heart, and soul. And thank you all for the love and support. I felt it, and I appreciate it. still grows, no stranger to you and me. These things right here, no joke. Trust me, no joke. You can't you claws. Can you imagine having claws other than fingers? Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Claw. Yeah. I actually love that they guess me because that means that my voice and my spirit and my passion for this is recognizable. And I like that part. Running just as fast as we can. Wow! I haven't sang on stage in over 20 years. The only time that I would usually sing is in the shower. <laughs> I was shaking in my boots every single performance because I didn't know who I was up against, but I knew that there were professional singers here. The ultimate competition was myself. My fears, insecurities, coming out of my shell. Girl, you made me very proud. Very, very proud. We made it halfway, baby. Mwah. You don't even know what we argue about. Oh. You I love you. tell you what, I think one of my biggest challenges was kind of picking songs. It's so much easier to listen to somebody else's song than to try and get in there and do it yourself. I can't wait to watch the episodes with the kids. I've like ran out of excuses as to where I'm going. It's like, are you working on a movie, Dad? No. But what are you working on? Well, it's... just leave me alone.